It's that time again. Time for another Super Wrap project. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Drive Talk Cars. In today's video, we're going to be doing another Super Wrap project and that is going to be painting the side mirrors gloss black. So if you've been following me, then you know that I'm a big fan of Super Wrap. I've used it on a few projects. I've done the calipers on the E63, calipers on the Maserati, and I've done the window trim on the E63. And I'll have the link to those videos in the description down below so you can check those out. And if you're not familiar with Super Wrap, in a nutshell, it's basically just sprayable vinyl wrap. And in my opinion, the spray wrap is a little bit better in some situations as opposed to the peel off traditional vinyl wrap. So let me show you the tools that we're gonna use for this job. Here are the tools needed for the job. First thing you want is a prep spray as well as a microfiber cloth. You wanna clear off any contaminants or dirt that may be on the surface. Next, you're gonna need some masking tape as well as some type of pre-taped plastic or you can even use masking paper. Next, you're gonna need your super wrap spray. I'm using gloss black. You can use any color that you like. And lastly, I'm using a mask. I'm using an N95 mask to protect from the fumes. And that's it for the stuff that you need to complete this job. First thing we're gonna do is spray down the mirror with prep spray. Let it sit for about a minute, and then we're going to wipe it down. After a minute, take your microfiber cloth and wipe it down. Focus on the cracks as well as the inside part here and on the back side here. All right, so after that, that's it. Make sure it's dry everywhere. You don't want any water in these cracks. And then we're gonna do the other side the same way. If you find that you still have contaminants in the surface of the paint, you can do a clay bar real quick, instant detailer clay bar. See if that gets it out before you proceed on to the next step. <laughs> So now I'm gonna hit it with the prep spray one more time just to get rid of any oils or anything that may be in the instant detailer. And then we should be good to go. All right, so now that we're done prepping this, we can mask off the light part. And then we're gonna mask the mirror part off as well. So let's get started. So now we're gonna use painter's tape to mask this off. Not the whole thing, of course, but the lights and the bottom piece here. If you don't have lights, then you don't have to do this, of course. So what I'm gonna do is just cover it up. Perfect. So I'm covering it up and then I'm outlining it with just my fingernail here so I can see where to trim it. So I'm just gonna slide it up underneath here. All right, so that's good for the back side. Let's move to the front of the mirror and tape that off. So I have my squeegee just to tuck the tape underneath or inside there, I should say. If you don't have this squeegee, you can always use a credit card. Now that we've taped off the turn signal as well as the glass part of the mirror, we can go ahead and use our plastic wrap to mask off the rest of the car. All right, so we're gonna cover the mirror up and what we wanna do is cut a hole, small hole, work the mirror through the hole. So right in here is a critical part. If this plastic is coming back on here, then you won't get the coverage on the mirror. So we're gonna bring this back and then tape it down. All right, so now that we have everything masked off, taped off, we can go ahead and start applying the Super Wrap. With the black, you don't need a base coat. 
you can just start off with the black. If you had a color, then you would have to use a white base coat and do five coats of that and five coats of the color. Since we just have the black, we're gonna do 10 wet coats with 10 to 15 minutes in between each coat. So let's jump into it. Oh, make sure you shake the can for a full minute. Make sure you have your mask and then we're ready to rock and roll. I like to do a final wipe. The first coat is going to be light. First coat is just a tack coat, so don't expect it to be a full coverage. What you see here is perfectly fine. Next pass, we're going to do a full wet coat. So between coats, I like to wipe off the sprayer here, the nozzle, just so there's no buildup of paint and they'll spray evenly. Just a little thing that I do, don't have to, but make sure that your sprayer is clean. If you like videos like this, as well as other DIY repairs, maintenance, or any other mods, click that subscribe button as well as that notification bell. That way you don't miss out on any future videos that I post. So let's get back in the video. All right, so we did 10 coats. Now it's time to let it dry overnight and we'll come back in the morning and see what it's looking like. And before you let the final coat dry, you wanna make sure you take the tape off that you masked. Well guys, Super Wrap didn't give me the results I was looking for this go around. Unlike the calipers, where it's very smooth and high gloss, the black is not looking that great. It's not that bad, but it's definitely not the results I was aiming for. This one is a semi-fail, semi-win, but at least you get to see the results of using the Super Wrap on your mirrors. Maybe if I didn't have this turn signal in the mirror, it may be a little different, but this is what it is. If you enjoyed this video, please give me that thumbs up. And remember, do it until you can't. Until next time, I'm out.